guys welcome back to my channel today I wanted to just share with you some of the items that I purchased from the Sephora VIB sale that was just this weekend as you guys know I don't like to go and spend like thousands of dollars in there um, at one time but I did pick up a few goodies and this video is not gonna be long but I just wanted to share with you guys what I purchased and I have tried all of these products so I can give you like a recommendation or kind of like a first impression on this stuff right here so let's just go ahead and jump right into the video because I hate long intros I got three eyeshadow palettes I have one highlighter one pair of lashes a lip kit and a foundation the first thing I got was the new Laura Mercier flawless fusion foundation I am in the shade nutmeg and I just did a video like two days ago on my first impression on this foundation and honestly you guys I know it's $48 but I love it very good coverage it doesn't oxidize I want to tell you it's like my exact shade it does have uh, one fluid ounce and like I said the price was 48 The next thing I got, it's new but it's not new, it's the Fenty Trophy Wipe. I've been trying to get my hands on it since it came out and it was sold out every single time I tried to purchase. But they finally had it when I went to Sephora this past weekend and I like it. Oh and I just dug my thumb right through it. See that? Okay, so I never really was going to use it like in this area. I kind of wanted to use it more for like body highlights, inner corner highlight, maybe a little bit of like nose, like down the center of my nose highlight. But I really didn't want to use it like above my like contour and all of that. It is really, really yellow as you guys can see. It is super yellow and it kind of has like that green undertone. Also, it's very, very glittery. And I've noticed when I use highlighters, I have like a lot of like glitter flecks in them I tend to break out right there so that's why I just wanted to use it for inner corner and body highlight and for that I mean I think it, it's I think it's gonna be gorgeous even just like me putting it like right here look at that oh Ooh, do you see that and that's just like one swipe and around so pretty so the next item I got is another pair of Huda Beauty lashes. I love Huda Beauty lashes. I feel like that's my favorite brand right now. And normally, if you guys have been following my channel or even like on my Facebook lives, Instagram, and I'll have all the links down below. I am like so devoted and faithful to the Scarlet number eights. The ones I have on today are Sasha 11s. And then I saw this pair. It is the Farad 12s now these are like more of a dramatic lash so if you have an eye shape that's smaller or if you don't have like that much lid space this may be overwhelming for you maybe try the samantha number eight they're long but they're not as thick and so if you have a smaller eye the samantha number eight will probably work good for you because you'll still be able to see like the eye makeup but if you have like a bigger lid and you just really like that dramatic lash effect i think you should try these these are really really pretty on i've only wore them once but i love them like a lot like a lot a lot i would definitely be repurchasing oh and i think the lashes are 20 bucks um, i didn't get this at the vi rouge i actually got this uh on my birthday i bought this for myself on my birthday it's the huda beauty lip contour lip contour lip contour set but i got vixen and famous which is more of the darker shade so it looks like this right here comes with the lip liner and two matte lippies so i actually have the lip liner on today it's called vixen and then it comes with the Vixen lip color. So there is the Vixen lippy and it does dry down matte. And right here is the matching liner. And then right above that is the shade Famous. So it is just a little bit darker so you can get that contour effect. And honestly, I love the formula of Huda Beauty. I have it on today. I wear pretty much every day <laughs> they're very comfortable it's not too drying it doesn't dry my lips out 
it feels like there's nothing on my lips and the shades are great and the last three products are palettes this one is the new cap on d saint and sinner palette i was debating for a while to get this and i was just like whatever i can get 20 percent off let me do it now i'm gonna regret it if i don't and i love this palette it's super big as you guys could like see when you open it these are the shades and they're super 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 pigmented i really was drawn to this color right here the shades are like super buttery and very blend very very well i love the color selection of course you can go from day to night super easily and anytime i'm looking for eyeshadow palettes that's what i look for and i recommend it next is the new palette by anastasia it is the prism palette i do have it on my eyes today and i'm so happy i ended up getting this palette of course sphere which is that neon shade which i have on my lid that's what drew me to the palette that and then this shade right here dimension which is kind of like that same type of color that was in that anastasia palette like that metallic lavender gray type of shade i was a little bit scared with that color this neon because i thought maybe it was gonna be chalky but it blends out like a dream good job anastasia and of course the packaging is i love the packaging it is like the same type of feeling like the modern renaissance but i like the fact that it's black and then the very last palette that i have i actually got for my birthday too um but it is a new release it is from rihanna's fenty beauty collection and it's the holiday set now i'm not really one for a whole bunch of glitter i'm not like a glitter fanatic but what i like about these is they're not so so glittery like they are perfect bright but when you put them on they're not so they're not overpowering it's more of like an iridescent type of glitter and i those are the glitters that i like these glitters remind me a lot of the moon dust shadows by urban decay i love the color selection the packaging of course is like super super cute i'm really really happy that i didn't have to take anything back normally when i do like hauls like this even whether i buy like five or six items there's always one thing i gotta take back but i love each and every one of these things that i got definitely do your reviews before purchasing anything big like that because these things can add up and they can be kind of expensive so definitely do your research this video is not super long i just wanted to share with you guys what i got at the vib sale that happened this past weekend if you went comment down below and let me know what you got if you have any of these products let me know what you think what are your thoughts and yeah if you want to see like a video of like this eye makeup look or me using any of these palettes that i recently purchased just give a thumbs up or comment down below please share this video and like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye